Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So direct storage is a new feature that's designed to take advantage of the power and speed of new NVMe SSDs, as I have posted previously, and is specifically of benefit in games and while gaming. And I'll leave links to one or two videos I have posted on direct storage in the description if you'd like some more info. Now, if your device does support the feature, it is available on Windows 11, and as I have mentioned previously, has also been added to Windows 10. Now, um, direct storage benefits if you have a very fast NVMe SSD, as mentioned. And believe it or not, the only game that carries support for direct storage currently is for Spoken, and over and above that, uh, the system requirements for the feature are actually quite steep. So for direct storage, you need a PCIe 3 NVMe SSD, and a GPU that supports DirectX 12, but uh, Microsoft does say that um, a GPU that supports DirectX 12 Ultimate would actually be ideal for the feature to be used on your system. Now, um, if you would like to check uh, if your Windows device and PC does carry support for direct storage, it's actually quite simple to do. And to check, we use a feature called the Game Bar, as many of you would know, which uh, is a standard feature in both Windows 10 and Windows 11. And the quickest way to activate the game bar would be just to use your Windows and G key on your keyboard. So using Windows and G, that'll open up the game bar. And you just head up to the gear icon, the settings, you click on that, and you would click on gaming features in the menu. And yeah, we get some very useful information related to direct storage. Now, first of all, right here at the top, you can see your system does not support DirectX 12 Ultimate. Now, as mentioned earlier in the video, um, um, DirectX 12 Ultimate is ideal for the feature, but isn't an actual system requirement. It just makes the experience better. And then, um, yeah, at the bottom, we get the actual information pertaining to direct storage. Now, it says GPU, direct storage supported. So my GPU supports direct storage. OS, this version of Windows supports the latest direct storage RO optimizations. So that's input-output optimizations. And this is the important bit here under drive status. Now, yeah, you can see um, whether your drives carry support for direct storage. And you can see that both of mine don't. Now, my C drive, which is my main drive, it says non-NVMe drive. Now, that's not entirely true. That's just pertaining to direct storage. I actually have an NVMe drive installed as my C drive, which I installed just a couple of weeks ago. But the reason it's saying non-NVMe drive is because my NVMe drive uh, is a PCIe 2 SSD. And as I mentioned earlier in the video, you need a PCIe 3 NVMe SSD as a system requirement. So that's why um, mine is not supported. And uh, um, if you do carry a supported um, SSD, um, you then can obviously, if you have more than one installed, you can select the best drive, um, as an example, uh, to install your games on. And um, obviously, the faster the drive, the better the performance. So just take note of that. And something else just, just to take note of, um, there is no actual option in Windows to turn on direct storage. As mentioned, your PC either supports the feature or it doesn't. So I hope that was useful. Just a quick way uh, to check if you um, do support the feature on Windows 10 and Windows 11. So thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.